1974, Mickey Adams sold over 70 million records. Mickey! By 1975, he was off the grid, a ghost. And now he haunts me because no one seems to know how to get rid of him. I managed Mickey Adams. He's a big, crazy baby. I am nuts. This is his latest CD he calls Doors. 10 minutes of a refrigerator opening and closing. Go up to Montecito and drop him. That old man is completely out of his skull. Mr. Adams, you really need to sign the contract? <laughs> I'm not going anywhere until you do. How's your sprightlier sprite? It's good. So he signed it? Mm. I take it you're aware that your table is melting? Sure. And that the walls are on fire? You bet. He signed it. Yeah! You drugged me! You gave me something! I'm an artist. I came from nothing. You want to dump me? The sound of doors opening and closing isn't art. There is nothing more evocative than the sound of doors opening and closing. Nothing more hopeful and nothing more final. Let me ask you something. How would you feel if everybody thinks you're a genius and then one day they decide that you're not? That, you carry with that you're over. You Mickey Adams didn't think he had anything left to say, but he does, and I know it. My life seems to be veering off somewhere. Do you know how long it's been since I played anything? I'm gonna write a hit. I think you are very quickly becoming my best friend. <laughs> Between love and hate, faith and fear, life and death, music is the space between. Bye.